guys it is Arika Misha and today we are doing some nails we are doing nails as usual and look at this beautiful tie dyed print I found I think it was CVS or Walgreens one of them I think it was Walgreens Cha, I be forgetting I be in both of those stores so much but anyway yes this is the design that we're doing today and I will make sure I link at the end of this video um the link to all well the end card of all my other uh, nail videos guys because you guys know I'm always doing my nails anyway so let's get into the box the box of nails so let's move this out the way um, and of course this is by kiss we get the box again these nails are by kiss i love the kiss nails i also really really love the five and below fox nails i love those nails they last a long time this is the pink glue guys i love the pink glue it lasts really long gonna give you guys a shot of those nails outside of the package look at that let me take this plastic off so y'all can really see i saw this i was like okay that's cute i like the uh the tie-dye black and white I like how they did that. Let me see. These nails here. All right. Look at that, guys. That is going to be really nice. I like the black and white tie-dye. I like that. Um, I definitely didn't want to do the whole cow print. I really don't like that print. Um, so I'd rather do this tied. I saw this tied tie-dye print and I was like, okay, I like that. I'd rather do that. I'm really not into the whole black and white cow print, but I do like this print. And I like the gold with it. I, if they would have had this in silver, I wouldn't have got it. But Because I didn't like it. But I like the gold. Um, I like silver too. Don't get me wrong. But something silver just don't go with. So, alright. Let's move this out the way. Uh, we've got our nails in here. We've got everything in here, guys. I'm really excited about this set. And of course, the kiss set comes with the nail file, a buffer, and all that. And I already do all that before I start my nails. So, I've got them all ready. So let me go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and pick out and size my nails and then I'll be back to show you guys how I put these on. Okay, we are back. Let's get into the nails. I've got my nails all laid out and I'm ready. Let's go. And guys, I've gotten so good at this doing my nails. I've gotten so good at this and let me tell you, I've gotten so good and I can do this so quick. And that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. It's so easy. And once you get so easy, so used to doing it, you know, because I do my nails about every three weeks. Every three weeks I do them. Um, I try to make them last longer than that, but let's just keep it real. They're not going to last you no two, three months, you know. So, I mean, even when I used to go to the salon, my set never lasts me that long. So, anyway, um, yeah, so these normally last me about three weeks, so. And I put my glue on, guys. And I just hold my nail down like that. Hold it down. Press it down real nice and firm. I do my thumbs last so that I can have my thumb. You know, the thumb is the pusher downer. I know that's not a word, but see, it's the, it's the finger that you use to push down and apply pressure. So that's why you want to do these last. I'm telling you guys, I have learned over time doing these. And, oh, that's pretty. I went with the uh, black and white print on the pinky. I think that's going to be really nice. I like to hold it down till I really, really feel it gripping really good, you know? That's what I like to do. Make sure it's all nice and firm. And I squeeze my sides to make sure they're all nice and firm. Squeeze my sides down to make sure the nail is down nice and firm. So when you look at the nail close up, look at that. Looks like it's coming out of the skin. Looks like it's your actual, well, you know, nobody believes your nail this black and white, but you know what I mean. Makes it look really nice and clean, nice and original. So I've got the first one on. And let me get the next one on. Show you guys how I do that. See how I just put that one drop of glue? Now, see, this nail is kind of bigger, so I'll put, like, two drops. And then I take the tip of the glue thing, and I just kind of spread it around. Sometimes I may do a third drop. Just depends on how it looks. You don't need a whole pile of glue, though. You definitely don't need that. So, 
I've got my glue on, you guys can see. I take the nail, I line it up. Make sure my, uh oh, make sure my nail's straight. Make sure I don't put it on crooked. Because sometimes I be putting these nails on and they be crooked. So I'm like, oh boy. So I got to make sure I'm looking at it. Make sure it's all lined up right. So let me put a little bit more glue on there. Because I don't think I put enough glue. Get some more glue on there. All right. Let's get our nail back on there. Sometimes you got to kind of, you know, make sure you got it on there right. Uh oh. All right, let me get some more glue. If it gives me problems, sometimes I'll just put it on the nail. Seems to work better that way. On the actual nail you're putting on. So maybe that's what it wants us to do. Make sure I got it on straight. I do not want to put it on crooked. Nope, not at all. Push it down on the sides to make sure. Make sure I got it on there straight. I do not want it on crooked. I'm telling you. Make sure you got it on nice and straight. I have put it on crooked before. And had to fight to get it off because it was so crooked. But, ooh, look at that. That is going to be pretty. That's going to be really nice, guys. Really nice. So, all right. I'm going to go ahead and finish up putting the nails on. Now, don't forget, I always like to remind you guys. I always use, I got this from the Dollar Tree. It is the Rapid Dry Top Coat. Make sure you guys can see it. Oh, um, my lighting. I guess it's too bright. But whatever. This is the Rapid Dry Top Coat. I always put, once I get my nails on, I put a layer of this across the top of the, I do like two, you know, two coats of this. That helps the um, nail stay strong. Helps to, you know, keeps the nail from breaking. You know, it helps your, your nails last longer. That's why my nails last me about three weeks. I'm telling y'all. They really do last that long. So, I'm going to go ahead and get the rest of them on. And I'll be back to let you guys see the finishing results, guys. And I'm going to go ahead, put my jewelry on. I'm going to do all that good stuff. All of that good stuff. Because y'all know I be getting excited when I put my jewelry. Okay. All right. That's enough. All right. Okay, guys. I'll be back. <laughs> okay. And here are my nails, guys. Here are the final, the final nails with the jewelry. You guys know how I like to do it. I like to put my jewelry on so you can get the full effect of the nails. I love the gold with the black and white. I love how they look together with gold jewelry. It looks really nice. I like that. Gorgeous. I love the combination. Now the black and white to me would not have looked good with silver, but I love how they did the gold. I'm glad it was gold because like I said, I like the print. And the nails are gorgeous. And I like how they made the thumbnail black. It was the only option I had. But you know what? I'm glad they went with a black nail. You know, to kind of bring the black and white out, you know. So I like how they did that. Because I like the, the solid black nail. I think it looks really sexy. I think it's pretty. Sexy. Pretty, guys. So, alright, guys. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media, guys. And don't forget, knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.